What's up guys, Remember here. I'm here to show you my ads from today. I went to Valley Village in Kannapolis as well as Scott's Collectibles, which is my, uh, basically my crack dealer, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Um, uh, showing you first what I bought from Valley Village. I did, an, I got this, uh, New Era Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series Victory Lane hat. Uh, I don't know which race it's from, but it is a New Era hat. Very plain New Era hat, something that I can just wear out in public or something like that. I also found this, this isn't going to fit in the screen by the way, by Cutter and Buck, a uh, DuPont Motorsports rain jacket, which is pretty nice for a couple bucks. And then in the case, I always end up looking in the cases because um, you never know what they're going to have. Usually it's there's one or two cars in there, and this time they had one I was looking for, which was Danny O'Quinn's uh, Sundrop promo. This has no windows in it, so this window's gone, this window's gone, and the side window is gone. The only thing it has, and the uh, right rear window is gone as well. The only window that's in there is a left front or left rear, and it also uh, doesn't sit right, so I'm going to have to do some surgery to it, apparently. Very nice color green. It's a nice me metallic green color, and the Sundrop logo on the hood is not of the best quality, as usual. Um for a lower tier series team and I believe this is JD Motorsports first die cast made <sighs> I'd have to think about that this is 09 10 they had the G and K prom, uh, promo and then 2013 I think so uh, but yeah that's my value village finds coming from Scott's I did pick up two Funko Pops that I've been putting off buying we have Kevin Harvick and Bubba Wallace one thing that pisses me off about this box is that it says Bubba Wallace Jr. that's not right his dad's nickname is not Bubba he his nickname is Bubba it would just be Bubba Wallace or it's Daryl Wallace Jr. it says that on the side as well there it says it and on the back it says it which isn't right obviously it, it's it, like I said, it pisses me off because that's not his dad's nickname, that's his nickname. But, uh, yeah, here's a closer look at Bubba. You can see the fade on there, which is pretty neat. And here's Kevin with his receding hairline. Um, and I, I know somebody's going to say something about it, but even though he has, in past years, like Kyle Busch, been losing his hair actually at a pretty rapid pace. Um, to finish this off... I also picked up, let's see, 9, 10, 11 cars. I got the new 2020, dang, that sounds weird to say, 2020 Ryan Blaney Body Armor Mustang. This DNP'd last year, I believe. So for this one to get made is uh, pretty neat. Adds to the Ryan Blaney collection. I am a completionist of him and Bubba and Daniel Hemrick. So I'm also trying to complete the Xfinity collection, you know, getting every one of those. And I added three to that. Here's Kevin Harvick's 88 Great Clips Chevy Camaro um, from 2014. A lot of people don't realize that he drove a, uh, a uh, an affiliate car for Hendrick. That's what I think Junior Motorsports is. It's just a Hendrick affiliate. So it's, uh, it's kind of weird. It's like realizing Tony Stewart drove for RCR once. <laughs> um, something you don't think about. Here's another random pickup. This is... Uh, this is Regan Smith's 2013 Goodies Headache Shot or Relief Shot Chevrolet. This is interesting because on the deck lid it says uh, CorvetteParts.net and has fire alarm services on there. And then finally we have Dale Earnhardt Jr.'s 2012 Tax Slayer Chevy Impala, which I didn't see in Scott's 5 for 25 bin at first. Next we have the Cup Cars. First up we have on the... PTC mold, I believe. Is that what it was at the time? Yes, it was. It's PTC. Very, very flimsy base and has the font for the uh, legal message. You know, that little slip of paper they give you with the base cards uh, in a different font as well. Very weird, very uh, kind of gross holding. I hate this mold, but I got it because it is a 2014, or, sorry, 2015 Kevin Harvick. Um, Jimmy John's cars with the lo the alcoholic logo on there. I think this is a pretty hard to find one, if I'm not mistaken. I highly doubt it, but you know whatever. I also picked up a set of canes. We have the 2016 Liftmaster Chevy and the 2014 
thanks a thank a million teachers Chevy. This is weird because it, not only is it on the oh it's on this is the WLS mold. Oh god, that's even worse. <laughs> Dang. So you go from uh, PTC with this one and WLS with this one. Awful. Both molds. They're the same kind of molds, but they're just gross. Here's why. Um, this car did not translate well onto this mold. Uh, it makes it look... Hang on, I'm going to adjust the light here so maybe you could see this a little better. You see that little... Uh, those scuff marks on that 5? Uh, not, not the top... Not the uh, scuff marks in the plastic there. I'm talking about the scuff marks in the 5. It, there's black marks in there. That was supposed to be a part of the die-cast design itself. And it just looks awful. <laughs> it looks gross. This LiftMaster car has a natural fade to it that makes it look like uh, the paint itself is fading off of it, but it's not. I didn't have that car for whatever reason. I'm just trying to fill in some gaps. Uh, we also picked up a random Danica Patrick 2013 All-Star car. Uh, it has GoDaddy Cares on the hood. And on the deck lid it says, Proud to Support uh, something. I don't know. Not really much different than, uh, there we go. Not really much different than uh, her typical GoDaddy car, but I don't have a whole lot of Danica stuff. So now would be probably the time to get that. I uh, also picked up a 2017 Daniel Suarez uh, Stanley Camry. This is his rookie car. The uh, right side of it looks a bit weird, but, you know, whatever. Uh, I got, I didn't just blow a hundred dollars off of nothing i ended up selling a 124 i ended up selling my aj allmendinger watkins glenn 124 and said you know what after it sat in my wallet for two weeks because i'm not allowed to uh put money in my bank account apparently uh because my bank doesn't have a drive through at least this location close to my house the next one i have to drive five or ten miles to get to I was like, all right, I'm not going to wait two months to deposit this. Let's spend it now. Why not? <laughs> also picked up a Kurt Busch State Water Heaters 2017 Ford. This is a really nice car. I really like that one. I took it out of the box. It looks great. And then finally we have from 2018 Matt Kenseth's Oscar Meyer Ford. I don't think I have this one. Um, if I did, oops, I guess I have two. But I'm pretty confident that I don't. So, yeah. Yeah, look at look at all these cars coming through there. Jeepers, cribes. So I'm going to put all these away. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Comment, like, and subscribe for more. And I'll see you later.